What's up guys? Um, today is the 19th of uh, May. Today is spring meet, uh, one of the first uh, cruisings of the year. Last year we had actually just as luck with the weather as we have today. As you can see it's really it's beautiful weather, 24 degrees or something. Sunny, just a few clouds all day. So I thought that we would head over there, check out the cars, uh, see how much people there is. I will first of all go and uh, wash my bike before we head over there because I haven't washed it uh, at all during the past winter. So let's do that first and uh, then head over there. Just to give you a little bit of a perspective, this is the entrance to Spring Meet, and from what I've heard later during the day, the queue stretched all the way from this point into Brunflu and back to the entrance again. That's a stretch of about 17 kilometers, and it must have taken hours waiting in line to get in this way. I'm really happy that I'm on a bike. Since I'm not really a morning person, and I also had to wash my bike before going to spring meet, spring meet was well on its way once I arrived there. Since Covid ended, it feels like a lot more people has been attending spring meet, because before Covid and Corona, sure there was a lot of people at spring meet, but uh, since Covid ended, it feels like uh, people do enjoy being outside more than they did before. So. Uh, last year I think we had an attendance record of about 11,000 people. I haven't seen any numbers for the 2024 spring meet, but from the looks of it I think there might have been a possibility for it to be an attendance record this year as well.
I've been here for two hours almost and I'm getting about ready to leave. Um, I met up with my little brother here as well and he is on his way out right now as well but uh, the queue for the cars are really long so I suspect it will take him like quite a bit to get out, probably like 30-45 minutes so yeah. Um, now I'm gonna go home, shower, eat some food and uh, Tonight there is a cruising. This is just like a summer meet, so uh, tonight there will be a lot of movement in the city as well, so I will go and check that out too. So, I made it into the city, uh, it's about uh, 10 o'clock right now and uh, it is a lot of people out. It's like you can hardly get from one side to the other in the city. So, it's very nice, a lot of drunk people, a lot of police and a lot of cool cars. And I'm looking for my little brother right now and uh, yeah, I will go to the store in a little while and then head back home again.
And as you can probably tell, it was getting a lot darker by the minute. Um, it was about 10.30 here and I knew that the store was closing at 11 and I needed some stuff before heading home. So I decided to call it a night, head over to the store and get my things and then head home again before it got too dark to even see the road. So we are back home again. It is about 11.30 at night. Um, it gets really cold and really dark still because it's only May. I couldn't stay too long because as you can see on my helmet I only have the, the dark visor so I can't see after like 10 o'clock. It was a really good day. We had awesome weather. There was a lot of people at the spring meet. There was a lot of people at the cruising as well. And the only thing that I am a little bit disappointed by is that uh, the airport that we have in Östersund is really, really close to the city center. So basically the whole city center is a no flight zone. So I couldn't get any drone footage whatsoever. Uh, I think that's it for this episode. Um, thank you for watching, if you did. And I hope that I'll see you in the next episode.